come back to ride with the four bags. And today, guess who I have in a building? You go ride or you no go ride. Come and slice in the building. Wow. I'm glad to have you on this show. I've been looking forward and it's finally here. Guys, guess who he is? The biggest YouTuber in the Arab country. The biggest. In fact, the whole diaspora. And so when we come to um, the Arab world, he has conquered everywhere. Qatar, Dubai, Saudi, Bahrain, Kuwait, everywhere. So he is by the name Thomas Lai. And today, I have a topic I want to discuss with him. And the topic is why African women don't support their partners when they are in they are in need of financial support. So if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please subscribe. The channel name is Efo Banks and the program is Ride with Efo Banks. So Mr. Kamaslai, why do African women don't want to support their partners when they need financial support? Well, this question big pass me. <laughs> how many women have I dated and how many are, how am I supposed to? No, no, well, be, 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 you say what? No, it's not about how many women you dated. I don't know I about that. But growing up, okay, right? You are with your parents. Mm -hmm. You live with your aunties and your other families. So you better know what I'm talking about. Even going forward, you um, if you you go out with a lady friend mm -hmm. who is an African mm -hmm. and you go to a restaurant, they always like you to do the bills. Yeah. You understand what I mean? Yeah. yeah so why do such things happen? In uh, part of Africa, well, in, um, in Africa, I will say whatever I will say will be based on my own. I mean, discretion, or if I should put it that way, I don't know. Whatever I will say is solely my point. Okay, uh, I'm not talking for all the men. Or yeah, all, all opinions are welcome. Uh, yeah, so, yeah. So, <laughs> yeah. Before you go into it, my name is Kamaslai. And I have a YouTube channel, Kamaslai TV. I'm not the biggest. I'm the biggest. Whatever, I beg. Don't mind him. I'm not even close. Please go and subscribe to my YouTube channel and let me hit some. Yeah, some that's it. Subscribe yeah. to the YouTube channel, Kamaslai TV. As well. <laughs> yeah, so whatever you are saying, I mean, I mean, it's not all African women that don't support their, their men. There are so many out there who support. Personally, I've gotten support from a lot of women, friends, and I mean, relatives and all of that. So it's not like all of them don't support. Then I think you are lucky. Yeah, I, personally, I mean, I was born lucky. Like when it comes to women, nah, it's people, not even about like you are fortunate, right? Which, whichever way, blessed. Whichever adjective you want to use or whatever you want to use. For me personally, since I was a kid, I knew this about me. It's one of one of the things I was gifted with. So okay. it, it's from God. So I, I, I would say for my side, I, I, I don't know. Everybody, they've been good to me. Unless I don't need, I, unless I don't ask. I, 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 I don't like asking actually. But yeah. some of them usually, they can even read and tell you need this and they do it for you. I, I'm just blessed like that. So when we talk about women not supporting, I feel the reason why women will feel reluctant to support um, their men or like you said, African women, right? Yeah, yeah, African yeah. women. African yeah. women in particular, uh, they find it difficult to support their men because, I mean, I think they feel or they, 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 they grew up knowing that it's a man's responsibility to provide for the, for the female, like the male responsibility to provide for the female. If you're a boy or girl or man or woman or young lady or young guy, so that's what I'm saying, let me use the male and female. They, they grew up knowing that it is the man's responsibility to provide. And even I think when you go with the Bible or the Quran or what have you, the holy books, they talk about the fact that it is the man's responsibility to swear to, to take care of the woman. So that that is one aspect of it. So if they are not helping you, it means they feel you are the one supposed to do it for them. But wait, wait a minute, is it really the, the responsibility of the of a man to take care of a woman? Yes, it is a man's responsibility. It is a man's responsibility. It's, it's a man's so why then like do the women wait? Why then do the women say what men can do, women can do better? That one, they, they just run their mouth. I mean, they, they say that all the time, but they, they only say that when they want it in their favor. But when you want to use it at a point where. They should know that look what you are saying you are just rubbing your mouth they, they don't admit to it so if you want to go by that women i mean i mean everybody know they should just stand there straight and pray <laughs> but personally i think that uh 
That is old. Perception. Thing. Yeah, it's, 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 it's outmoded. Yeah. yeah it's they out. should be removed from the system. Because yes. Since ladies are saying what men can do, women can do better. Yeah. And nowadays in our in, in nowadays societies, okay, there are a lot of uh, women, women who are empowering um, the world. Yeah. You understand? Who are who are like uh, what, what what will I put it? They are influencing the world like in a, in a, in. Uh, they are giving bigger impact in the world. Yes. So I think it's time they should, I, I mean our African women, it's time they should remove that uh, perception from their mind. Yeah, it, it's, it's true. They should. And like talking about that, most of them are also supporting. So if you say it's time, yeah, then you should are, also know that it's time no, and a lot no, of them are they, 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 they are but, just few, you know, a handful. Just few. But what I, want, what I really want to point out is that, for example, if a man marries a woman, okay, they, they want to start a business, right? So the man will gather some money, give it to the woman, for the woman to start a business. But when there, there is time of need, instead of that woman to even take out some money to support the man, it's very difficult for them. And even some end up leaving the relationship just because of this. Like when you go broke, they leave you. Yes, they leave you. But they forgot that when things were going on well, you were giving them the money, you were giving them the maximum support. Yeah. So during difficult days, they should also stay and yeah, sure. support the family. Yeah, sure. Mostly you find this in Africa. I'm, I'm emphasizing on African women because I grew up in Africa and I don't I know most part of the world also, but Africa is critical. I know really no, no conscious woman would, would, would not want to give their money. Like if you give them reason to give you money they will give you they are they are they are women like that some Bro. men don't get it because they don't give them reason or they know you are not going to do something positive with it they know you see african women are dependent let me let me put it that way yeah they are, african, they are one thing i want you to see, understand it african women see. are traditional women let me tell you get it from this point they are very very local so, uh, uh, and traditional uh, uh, uh. You know are, you, are you telling me it's their culture too? It is the culture, that's what I'm coming to. I said they are very traditional, they go with their culture and they understand the basis of it. That's why when you tell an African woman, cook for me to eat, she will not fight with you. Because she knows it's her responsibility. But if another woman in the West, you can't tell her, she will tell you that it's not my sole responsibility. You know, uh, in, in just a few days, so, I, was, I was chatting with this lady and um, she was like, I, I was like, oh, so since you are ready to come and marry, you want to marry, right? Come and marry me. And what she told me was like, why should uh, a lady spend the money to marry a, a, a man? At the end of the day, there won't be like respect in the relationship. It's like the, the, the woman is it's the forcing... person an African. Yes, yeah. yes, she's an African. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was on a live uh, with uh, La Global just recent days, and Sandy Kamel also talked about this that in the in previous days they used to support men with their money, but they didn't know it was foolishness, and she will never repeat such mistakes again. Yeah. Because when you, when a lady um, gives out the maximum support to their guys, they take advantage of them. First but of, I think first of me, the person you are using as a as a case study, the person you are using, she she is not a serious person for me when it comes to relationships. So I will not take advice from such a person. Sandy Kamel is nobody to to look up to or for her to tell me she was stupid and she yeah she is stupid. So such a person cannot. No, but, but, but come on, come on. I I felt I felt for her because you you know what she went through. Just imagine if, if let's that was not her let's not even make her the center of of, of discussion over here. Okay. You've never heard from the guy's aspect. You you were always hearing about about her relationship from her okay, side. Let, let, let's so we that, let's shouldn't even go there. So she's in no position to advise anybody on. What I think mean? I think you have personal. I don't have anything. With I don't know her. I've not met her before. But I just I just I. I, I I don't like women who run their mouth a lot. So, okay. so yeah. you okay? See, bro, uh, spending few days in um, the Gulf country, right? Yeah. I once went out with uh, my Indian friends, mm -hmm. and uh, after everything, yeah. we shared the bill with the ladies. Yeah, that would not, happen. That would not happen in Africa. But no. <laughs> back in my country, you have to pay for the ladies' transportation. Mm -hmm. You have to pay for their bills, mm -hmm. and even some of them will be looking for, like, looking up to you to give them some money yes. to take home. Yeah. Like I, I th see personally, I cannot go out with ladies and expect them to pay a dime. No, 
I will not go out with a lady and split bill. Like I see the European, especially the people in the UK, they do that a lot. They go yeah, out. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They split bill. Hey babe, bring fifty. Let me bring fifty. No, see, listen. As like, especially they do it over there. No, I can't do that. For me, it's either you pay it all or I pay it all. So if, why don't, if I don't have it, you pay. So why don't this perception change? Change how? There should be a change. We are we are in a we are in a in the modern world. Why should we copy everything from the West? What do they copy from us? Must we copy because it's the West? Is the is the it's European not who are, the are West. they are splitting bills? So we Africans should also start splitting. To me, I think no. We have our African values. ladies are stingy. It's not about value, bro. No, we have. For me, I'm talking about you asking me. So I'm talking from my. But if I go out with my woman, and I feel like I can pay the bill, I'll pay every, everything. I will not say, babe, bring this. Let me add this to it. No, I would not do that. It's either I pay or I'll tell you, babe today I don't have money. Pay when I get, I'll give it to you. I'll, and I'll give you everything. I will not split with you. So for me, that's. Oh, but splitting bills Guys, stuff. No, put no, no. this in the comment section. I think this guy will spoil their women. No, what I would, do you think? It's not, it's, you, you can put it whichever way you want, but I'm just telling you from my perspective, I cannot go out and split bill with a lady. No. It's, it's first of all, it's disrespectful. So, are you telling me that I'm stingy right here? Or I don't know. You how, are telling no. the, the men out there who need the support of their ladies that they are stingy. No. Men, we need support from women. I said it. We, we, when you get support, it's good. I've gotten support from women, not dating per se, but some of them dated, some of them just friends, some of them relatives. I've gotten. Okay, my point is, my point is yeah. solely based on dating. relationships. Relationships. Yeah. Be it courtship, mm -hmm. girlfriend, boyfriend, yeah. fiancés, yeah. marriage. Mm -hmm. See, I, I know what I'm talking about. Yeah. I know what women will be having the money, mm -hmm. but instead, you guys will be hungry, mm -hmm. and instead of her to room that money to buy food. She will be waiting for you to go out there, make a move, and bring something back home. For me, it's a privilege for you. Eh? It's a privilege that a woman will have the money and spend it on you. It is not your right. It is not your right. It's a privilege. She can choose to give you. She can choose not to give you. So it's a privilege if she does that. But if she doesn't, it doesn't make her stingy. She should be flexible enough, yes. She can help, yes. But don't make it like it's her right or it's, it's her responsibility. No. You, you, like some people will say, I've gone out with somebody before and she said, I was the one who called for the date. I was the one who said we should go out, so I'll pay. A lady? Yes, a lady. And she paid. Wow. She paid. I was surprised. She paid. I've never I, met such opportunities. Oh, no. So many times. Yeah, like I tell you, I'm a lucky guy. See, she said, I called for this date. She paid everything. I brought wow. my card out. She brought her own out. She said, okay, bring your card. She took my card, hid it, and used her card to pay. So many times. African. An African. But she doesn't Daniel. have an African mentality. <laughs> Anyways, guys. Yeah. Um, so I think the, <laughs> we should be ending this conversation see, here. Because if I leave this, my brother, he would defend the ladies. No, and I'm me. Not, I'm not I just to want, them. to me, I want that perception to change for, for, for now. Because we are in a modern world. And if I leave this guy... He will say a lot. No, it will take a long time for <laughs> it to change. You get it. it so, guys, I want you to put in the comment section whether you support the motion that African women should start supporting their men, mm -hmm. should start splitting bills, mm -hmm. should give maximum support to their men if they are in need. You, put it in the comment you, section. You asked a question. I thought you were going to request for more points. We just gave one point and everything. No, it's you should okay. have given. Other reasons. That's we just gave one point why, and there are other reasons over there. You said you're. Well, what What are the reasons? What are the reasons? No, some of them also is influenced by their friends. You know, if okay. if, if 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 you go out and you spend money on your guy, their friends say, oh, "Wait, you are a fool. You are this and that." Those, that, that, those that are I made that no, point. No, there are more reasons. There are more reasons, but you 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 you, you narrate you, like how you are. You limited me to just you are coming back and forth with me on this one. Like there are more reasons that we could have given. To justify why because the question is why don't they why don't they so there are other reasons there are more reasons but it's to me i reason. think is the is the is the culture thing <laughs> the culture plays a role because see it's difficult to take something see they, they i'm telling you they grew up and anything ch children eh, or a child whatever you are doing growing up they watch this and it enters their dna it's like in their dna it's difficult to take it out. Oh. That's why somebody will travel to Europe. They will not be able to adapt to the European style. It will take them a long time because, bro, you don't know. And there, there are a lot of reasons. And some, guys, some I, know, I know you guys are enjoying this conversation, but I am bored. I am angry with this guy. Oh, why? 
I have brought him on the show. No. He I'm, want to defend the ladies. I'm not defending. I'm just I'm telling not you the reality. And the show is my show. Okay. So I am. <laughs> so do whatever you want. To do. I am ending the show here. Mm. See you guys next time on Ride with the Four Banks. If you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe to the channel and Four Banks and watch out for more exciting, exclusive interviews, travel gigs, job opportunities. This is my brother Kamas Dai, the biggest YouTuber. You go ride or you no go ride, ride with Alpha Bang.